Nice Camp Sundays! Oh yeah! Hello, I'm the Game Beaver, and welcome back to another Face Cam Sunday! And today, I'm wearing a green hoodie. Why, you might ask? Well, because somebody challenged me to wear a green hoodie, and uh, yeah, I I'm, I'm wearing a green hoodie today. Because they thought if I wear a green hoodie, that I'll disappear! Well, I'll have you know, this is a very special form of editing I use. And no, I don't go in frame by frame and pretty much key, like, I have to, like, crop it, like, mask me out every every second. I'm going to be continuously touching my hair in this video because it's a mess and I need a cut and it needs something done. <laughs> so today we're going to be going in with the official scenario. Now, this is the last plague I'll do because we've done them all now, but I didn't do one. If you remember, if you watched these, I think it was episode five or six, it was one of those. It was the Christmas scenario where you were supposed to infect the world with Christmas cheer. And I didn't do it right. Um, I picked just the normal Neurox worm. And I didn't realize that if you go into official scenarios up there and click play, there it is. Santa's little helper. And this is the actual legit one. There is loads. Uh, like, look at all these. Global warming, ice age, minor earth, pirate plague. Uh... There's, there's loads of these cool official, um, official ones, like xenophobia, who cares, volcanic ash, I'm guessing that's, that might have been out, uh, when, like, that volcano erupted in Greenland or Iceland it was, maybe it's possible, um, so we're gonna go in with Santa's little helper, this should be a good one, and let's see what we can do, we have a gene here, ooh, Give Plague a bonus in hot climates. Hell yeah, we'll get that. ATP boost. No. Get uh, orange. More DNA from orange. Uh, increase the chance of plague mutating. Uh, your plague is harder to cure. I think I'd rather have that, actually. That's a good one. Uh, we'll get aerocide. So it's easier spread by plane. And the last one. Bonus DNA when devolving. Or symptoms costs don't increase, but easier to cure. I think that's a good one. So we're going to go in with that, and I'm going to answer a question today, because in these Facecam Sundays, I like answering questions. And if you have one, feel free to leave it in the comments below, and hopefully I'll answer it in the next video, hopefully. Uh, it won't be a plague one, it'll be something, uh, something different. I think I've got something special in mind, if I can pull it off. Because um, the way I record these is different to how I want to record this one. So hopefully, we can all be okay. So... What should we call it, Xmas? The, for the final plague. For the final plague. Um, I think I've already done it before, but I want to do it again. I want to do the beaver fever again. Uh, how about the gaming beaver fever? Yeah, <laughs> that's original. So let's play. So the question I was asked, is uh, how did you and Whitney meet? Now the guy who, or person, who asked this question has asked it many a times and I, it's not that I haven't like deliberately not answered it, it's just, I, it's went whoo over my head. I've went, oh, that would be a good one to answer. What, what, what else is there? <laughs> like, just continue reading my emails. And I will answer that in a second, but let's quickly crack on with this. Holidays, laughter, and celebrations have been banned. The world is so sad and boring that even the Neurox worm is upset. Poor little guy. Uh, it decides to rescue humanity and make them happy again. So he's gonna work with uh, with Santa Claus. Santa Claus! So I, I like starting in Saudi Arabia. I don't have anything against people in Saudi Arabia, but it seems to be the easiest now. Game Beaver is a f the Game of Beaver Fever is a force for good. Game Beaver Fever can increase the happiness of infected people. Uh, happy people will infect others and are less likely to work on a cure because they like being happy. Um, now, it's all closed, there is no borders, there is no nothing. But what is amazing about this thing is if we go to here, we go to transmission, uh, symptoms and abilities, they're all like unique, they're all different, which is awesome. Um, so while, while we're slowly infecting people in Saudi Arabia, um, I'll speed it up a little bit actually. I do this a lot, I rub my nose. I, when I'm stressed or, not when I'm stressed, but when I'm just working on something, I do that a lot. Uh, when I was in uni, I had somebody like ask me, do you have an itchy nose? 
I'm like, no. Because I see you rubbing it a lot. <laughs> That's what I do, I'd be like working on my animation and just go. Like every every so often I would just like, it's just something I do. Actually I do have a itchy nose now. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, how do we meet? Um, it was actually uh, during uni and uh, God, this is so hard to do. I, I'm not one who can just talk and play games at the same time. Unless it's a really easy game like Dust Power Builder. God, I look like a right scruff today, don't I? Jeez. Uh, <laughs> so how are we going to transmit? We have Cracker Cocoon. Severely de dehydrated worms from cocoons. Uh, and if pulled, pop and spread eggs. That's beautiful. Uh, for a fair weather friend. Worms develop a mild dislike of rain, preferring to snuggle with humans indoors and watch old movies. I love these descriptions. We'll get the solar perfume. Neurox worms attracted to the smell of sun cream and sweat. Yay! So that's gonna be good for us. Um, so I was going for an, we were on a night out. This is back in my uni days when we'd go out all the time, go clubbing and stuff, drink till there was no end. <laughs> I don't do that anymore. Those days have passed me. But, um... And I, one of my friends, uh, oh god, this is, it's hard to explain actually, because I, I was quite a naughty boy. Uh, <laughs> I was at the time seeing somebody, but it wasn't, it wasn't like going amazingly well. Um, I'd already broken up once. Um, don't get me wrong, there was nothing wrong with her. It was just that we weren't, like, compatible. Like, we had different interests and stuff. There was nothing wrong with... No one was bad. No one was, like, you know, getting upset with the other one. It's just... We, we just didn't click. Um, so, ooh, what's, what's this one? New York's woman driven into frenzy by the smell of sun cream. Do you love that? Do you... Like, this is something I do. I get a bottle of sun cream. And if you just, like, squeeze it and, like, it'll puff out air, not sun cream. If it's a full one, don't do that. Don't go... Because it'll go over your face. <laughs> But if you get that smell, it's like, oh, it's holiday. I think I'm a Neurox worm. <laughs> Do I go get that one? And um, and one of my mates at uni uh, actually liked Whitney. I'm pointing over there because she's, she's probably over there in, in a different room. And uh, um, now I, I didn't know anything about it. I'd never met her before. And it was Halloween and I dressed as Slenderman. Put picture up here. <laughs> and as I was doing, as I was just a slender man, we went to town and I had my mask on so I couldn't really see very well. But all I, the first thing she ever said to me was, that has to be the worst slender man costume I have ever seen. This is the first thing she said to me. First thing. Horrendous. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Sunny set up, the smell of barbecue accelerates the hatching of Neurox worm. I think we want to get um, abilities. Actually, no, we're okay. I think we're okay with transmissions. What's this? Your worms develop telepathic abilities which help them locate humans who are sad, uh, lonely, and un uninfected. Oh, that's cute. Poor little wormy, trying to help people out. Uh, what's this one? Worms develop. Um, oh, that's a mild like, dislike to rain. New York's worms enjoy laying eggs in the snow, where they can easily be scooped up. Uh, that would be a good one, right? I mean, we're gonna eventually go to. I like the cracker cocoon one as well, but we'll get we'll get the cold resistance. What did I just get? Uh, Neurox worms roll themselves into perfectly formed <laughs> formed snowballs and wait, uh, increasing their infectivity. What are symptoms? Uh, Santa's little Neurox worm mind control can be a power for good. Breach the blood slash brain barrier to access the host's brain and start making them happy again. Ah, oh, we'll get that one. We just I'll save up loads of DNA points and we'll quickly go for that. So back to the story, and um, like, uh, we, 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 went, we went out, we like, had a couple of drinks and whatnot, and uh, and then it was, ooh, wow, we infected all the way down there, how did that even happen? Okay, who was it? East Africa, oh, okay, I guess I could have got over that little, little bit of uh, ocean there. Uh, new happiness disease spreading, no, how dare you? Uh, oh wow, it's fully infected that country, infecting more countries. And it was when we, were, it was near the end of the night. Actually, we were sat in a club, and uh, like I asked her to sit down next to me, and we just got, we just started chatting. And she had these like um, wristbands on her on her arm, and I, they were just like general bangles that like, girls get from Claire or like just like naff things. They, you know, they had like names on them and stuff. So I knew there was something like 
knew about it. Oh, what's this? Who threat level increased? How? What have I done? I'm just trying to make the world happy. Uh, abilities. Uh, pathogen becomes harder to analyze in the lab. Uh, decreases future research speeds. We should probably get that. These are presents. Nurek's room hides away in a particular in a parcel and is posted to a random country as a present. Let's go one of those! Where are we going? Where, where is it? Where'd it go? Oh, sorry, we infected that. Okay, and then I'm gonna get loads of symptoms now because there's something cool you can do with this. I played it once before, just once. Uh, just to see what it was like, if it was like worthy of making an episode. Especially for the final, there should be something cool. So, um, and we started chatting that night and then, uh, like, it just sort of accelerated from there, so I think that's it, that's the question answered. How do we meet? That's how we meet, how we met. Um, if you have any more questions or, you know, things you want me to answer, we'll get more on a personal level here. You can leave them in the description below. I've just realized, oh god, they, uh, the cure is 25%. Um, I think I've done this wrong. <laughs> I haven't been like, uh, okay, uh, tendril production in the cerebral cavities begins, enabling increased control over host brain and here we go these are the cool things um so what's this melatro mel melatronin tap helps hosts realize that being happy makes them enjoy life more uh <laughs> they are less interested in researching on the cure uh yes we'll get that and what's this one host takes happy selfies and shares them <laughs> with the world Small chance to tempt people in uninfecting countries to open their border, borders, ports, and what have you. Uh, abilities. Oh, this is the cool one! Overwhelmed with generosity, hosts charter planes to use them to deliver Nurex worms as presents to people all over the world. Isn't that a lovely one? We're gonna save up for that one because I think that's a pretty cool one. Uh, here we go. So this is a cool ability. This one is what makes this really cool. Yeah, we're overwhelmed with joy. So now we can take this plane and go somewhere. Um, I'm gonna go with another popular one, uh, China. So there goes the plane, Bush. So now we've infected that, we get more DNA. Uh, and you can upgrade the plane. So uh, gift planes use parachutes to deliver presents to people from a greater height. More presents can be delivered at once. So, like, we, we did 22 presents there, which wasn't too many. Uh, the cure is still going quite quite well. Was his host can't wait to deliver the presents and decide to leave ahead of schedule. Gift planes fly more frequently. This is so good. I love this. I, I, I love, like, when they just do unique things like this. Unfortunately, the cure is going at an alarming rate. Oh! Already? Uh, go there! Whee! I think that costs DNA to do it. Um, does it? No, it doesn't. They just sort of go wherever they please. So we're going to get early departure. Uh, what's this one? Hosts on gift planes get a surge of happiness when giving presents to others. Increases DNA gain from each trip. Okay, well, I'm going to save for these plane rides. Uh, Game of Beaver mutation patterns extraordinary. I'm struggling to understand the extraordinary mutation pattern who damage cure efforts. So we go 59 to 57. Uh, we shall go to Canada! Oh god. Yes! Yes! Keep giving me stuff. Uh, more presents delivered and. Oh god, I got that without even knowing. <laughs> Gift planes use ingenious technique to deliver gifts down chimneys. Ah! Oh. More presents can be delivered at once. Isn't that what every kid wants? Okay, so now that they fly more frequently, we get more DNA from them. Uh, we shall visit Mexico. I should visit India, actually. Oh, wow. Come on, the queue is like 75%. This is not good. This is not good. New Zealand leading global cure. Where is New Zealand? Oh, there it is. Uh, let's kill New Zealand. <laughs> Egypt becoming happy. How dare it. And what's this? Red suit pilot. Uh, a famous man with a white beard comes out of retirement to fly gift planes. More presents can be de delivered at once. Now, we could get that. 
Or we could get a pushback. That does cost 26 DNA. I am tempted to get that because, like, we're at 85% now. Let's go to Australia. Oh, God. Um, happiness Curie. Oh, Jesus. It's close. Get the pushback. Oh, how much is that going to push us? 16%. That's going to be enough. It's going to be enough. Um, let's go to the Philip. No, let's go to India. I don't think India's infected, and India's going to be a great one. Uh, we shall go to England because that's a wealthy country. Uh, <laughs> and they'll be do working on the on the uh, cure. Oh, then then 92%. Ooh, 93. Get that. Oh, 33 DNA for that pushback. That's crazy. Oh god, I didn't mean to do that. We flew nowhere. We flew absolutely nowhere. No. Um. Oh god, I'm not gonna do this. Uh, ma manipulation of hypothalamus lets hosts understand how happiness can tr transform people's lives. They often refuse to work on the cure. Yes! Get that! A normal tap helps hosts realize that long-term happiness is the most important thing in life! People are realizing now! I hope so. Like, that's what I'm- that's what I'm wanting. Uh, it's gonna go to- Go to France, Spain. So let's go to Spain. Um, what's this? Hosting small chance of ten people in uninfected countries to open their borders. Uh, we'll get that. What's this? Lapton blockers cause hosts to lose self-control and do all sorts of things they wouldn't normally do, increasing infectivity. Let's go for that one. Uh, serotonin adjustments encourage hard partying. Lots of social socializing. And loss of inhib inhib inhibitions, increasing effectivity. We could get that one. I'm tempted, I'm tempted. H hormone adjustments trigger joke telling. It increases infectivity. Increases infectivity. Uh, abilities. Oh, we've got, we got no more pushbacks on that DNA. So now we just have to go for transmissions. Uh, worms develop. Uh, okay, humans are sad and lonely. And what increases their infectivity? Um... I'm gonna save. What's this? Increased serotonin production ca causes hosts to laze around all day. Uh, reduces happiness. We don't want that one, do we? No! Get partying! We'll get partying and then this one's... Oh, that's bad. But reduces happiness due to hangover. No, we don't want that one. No, 88! 89! 90! 91! Oh! Uh, no! Gotta go somewhere! Sweden! IQ device announced. Applesoft announced new IQ device to help cure the Game & Beaver release. No! No, not good! Not good! Um... Go on, let's get Santa Claus before we... I think we've lost. I'd say we, I think we've lost. I'm probably gonna do, cut and do this again where we're up to the same stage, but this time I've done it better. Um, if we do lose, which I think we are going to, because as soon as our IQ device gets announced, that's it. Uh, friendship! Let's get friendship, and then affection. Mm. <laughs> oh, come on! Come on, the, the more things we do to it, the better. Oh, God. Um, how's New Zealand doing for infectivity? Let's get them again. Oh, 95%! Oh, get that, get that. The more crazy we make this virus, the more we push it back, I think. Yeah, it's 92 now instead of 95. 94! No, oh, come on! Ugh. Um, let's get... India's fully infected. Kazakhstan. America. Let's get America. 95%. 96%. Love! Let's get love! 94! 95! Ah, 96! Um, joy! Joy to the world! <laughs> the world will love us! Sloth! I don't know if that's a good thing. Um, in fact, Russia. 97! 98! 99! <laughs> abilities! Abilities! Um, what's this? Nurex worms can f turn white to camouflage themselves against the snow. Increasing effectivity, especially in that. 
Completely special. In arid countries, uh, women develop a mild dislike to. Oh, I should have done that! Down! Darn it! I should have done that! Oh, I see. I see what I should have done. Um, look at that. Gluttony! Um, we'll get the selfie. We'll get the digital herd. Chance to tempt people into uninfected crops in their borders, ports, and airport. Uh, host, hosts film YouTube videos of their happy life, significantly increasing chance that people are in, are in, infect, in infected, in uninfected countries will open their borders. Um, uh, also, oh god, I'm running out of things to do. I probably should have saved for that, it costs 30. Hopefully we can get some pushback with that. No, I reached 100! Ah, that's it. That's it. We lost. Oh man, so close, so close. Okay, because of this, this is the last one. I'm gonna redo it again because that sucks. That that really does suck. Okay, we're back this time. It should be better. It should be. Fingers crossed. I've done more things right this time. So, uh, worms attracted to waterproof footwear to protect their eggs from the rain increase in infectivity, especially in humid countries. Um. Have we already got that? No, we don't have that one actually. Uh, there's these ones are pretty cool. Worms broadcast happy songs, disrupting silent nights and drawing people towards them. Uh, increases infectivity, especially in urban areas. That's good. That's a good one. It does cost a fair bit. This one's worms make themselves look cute and cuddly before going to sleep in toy shops. Increasing infectivity, in especially in rich countries. People are buying these beautiful cuddly things. Worms use bioluminescence to emit comforting warm glows. I like that one. I like that. So they're, they're like little Christmas lights. <laughs> uh, let's go to Sweden. Uh, digital elf symptom mutated. What's that? Digital elf. Digital elf symptom. It was a symptom. Was it? Oh, right. Okay, so now they're more likely to open the borders. Oh, that's okay. That's that's cool. I can live with that. So, um, I'm probably gonna get increase the planes going out. I think that's this time. Canada is starting to work on the cure. We're gonna infect Greenland, the home city. Oh my God! It fell almost instantaneously. Uh, okay, we need to infect Australia. Uh, look at this! Look at this! Go! Uh, let's infect New Zealand because I bet nobody's there. Stop the cure bad, Canada! We've got a hundred points! Okay, let's knock that research down. Let's get Santa Claus! Um, make people feel happy. Give them partying. Uh, transmission, what's this? Wild side! Uh, worms link telepathically to animals and use them to carry eggs far and wide. Increases in infectivity, what's this one? Memory lane. Memory lane. Lane? I think it's lane. Worms use pheromones which simulate happy childhood memories and draw people towards it increasing effectivity uh, I quite like the uh, stocking filler uh, they make themselves all cute and cuddly I like that sort of look they got going for them oh god the phones go mental uh, oh god we see we're doing really well now we've only 45% on the cure uh, and Canada fell instantly as well I'm not even speeding this up that much the whole world will be happy. So what can we get? Look at look at that Neurex worm. Go. Um, oh, do we have that? Oh, no. We're going to devolve that. I don't care if it costs. We don't want people unhappy. Uh, transmissions. Gold digger. Worms become fixated on shiny gadgets and jewelry. Ruthless hunting that ruthless, ruthlessly hunting their owners increases in infectivity, especially in rich countries. I like I like the idea of worms riding reindeer. I think we're gonna get that. We've got reindeer, we've got Santa Claus. Um, more planes. I want more planes. So, uh, New Guinea hasn't been affected, I don't think. Uh, cure is 50%, but that's okay, because the whole world will soon be happy. Uh, I need more planes. Can we get the fire? Oh, what's this? Red Nose Guide, a famous reindeer, flies ahead of gift planes, using his red nose to help them navigate around bad weather. Gift planes fly more frequently. Let's get them. Let's get Rudolph. Ah, we got Rudolph and Santa. What more could you want? Okay, who, uh, oh, the Philippines has yet to have anything happy come to it. Have this and Japan. Oh, is Japan? No, Japan's not infected either. Um, 
Okay, let's infect Japan. Take this, Nintendo. Oh, Iceland's one of the last ones. Let's go to Iceland. And what can we get? Um. Oh, we've already we've already got flying on like creatures. So I think I think we're done actually. I think that's it. Like it just shows, just making a couple couple of things change. Oh, Madagascar is the last one to be infected. And there it goes. Boom! Fallen! And I think that's it, actually. No, I missed the bubble! Where can we fly? Who's not infected yet? It's gotta be somewhere. Is it, is it Japan? No. Is it Madagascar? No. There's somewhere that's not really that infected. But where? Is it, is it Iceland? No. There is so- Oh! Here it is! It's the Caribbean! The Caribbean's the last one! And it falls! Yes! I think that's everywhere infected. There are no healthy people left in the world. So now we've just gotta... Uh, do abilities? No, we've done that. Stop the cure, and we just wait until everybody gets happy. The Game Beaver Fever brings joy to the world! The Neurox Worm has saved the world! Humans have a bright new future ahead of them, living together in eternal happiness. Have a great holiday! And there you go. That's it. We just made everybody's lives just a little bit more happy. In fact, probably a lot more happy. So that's it. I got a score of one. One out of three. I don't know how, maybe if you do the harder levels, then that's how you do it. But yeah, <laughs> that's how you do it. But uh, this is the last one for Plague. If you have any uh, suggestions of what I should play, I do have a few ideas few ideas of what games I want to play but um, and I have a new new idea for a new series that I want to play actually um, so again thank you guys for being here for I mean what are we now almost 50,000 subscribers and then before we know we'll be hitting 100,000 then before we know that it'll be 250,000 before we know that it'll be a million and this will be like a far-off memory of like do you remember when he used to do plague do you remember face can play god it was ages ago and now he's playing Five Nights at Freddy's 20 because they won't stop making that game. <laughs> and I, I don't want to play it because it's scary. <laughs> so yeah, leave, leave a comment if you've got any questions, leave a comment if you've got any uh, games you think I should play in the next Facecam Sunday sort of videos. And I hope you've enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you have. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye bye.